We're constantly learning, and then when we do get out of high school or college, we'll be able to work right away. The facilities are amazing. Some of the stuff they have in here, you would never see out in just a regular high school. We're a small, tight community, and we all work together. So this way, you can always learn ahead of time, see you know what you want to do, and if you really want to do it, and if it's for you. Careers are under construction at Northside's fifth magnet school, Construction Careers Academy. Students are laying the foundation for their futures and exploring professions in the construction industry. They will graduate equipped with the tools to enter college and the workforce. Educators and industry leaders have long recognized the need for more skilled workers in construction fields and thought of high school programs as training ground for future leaders. Half of my family is in the education field and the other half is in the construction and engineering field. So at Christmas dinner one day we were talking and we decided that there was just a lag of, of qualified workers in the construction field. And my dad said then it's imperative that the schools do something about that. That skilled level of, uh, of the construction trades is something that's been uh, diminishing uh, over the decades and as people see as a real um, need and opportunity if you're one of those young students. They're really getting a jump start and they're thinking about the possibility of working in a very rewarding career where they get to uh, enjoy high paying jobs that require specific skills. With strong support from the Citizens Bond Committee and the community, Construction Careers Academy was funded by School Bond 2007 and opened in August 2009 on the Warren High School campus. The new state-of-the-art building opened in August 2010, complete with classroom space and specialty labs. From the start, Construction Careers Academy students are immersed in basic construction courses and hands-on activities with an emphasis on safety. As soon as they pass their safety test and they go through the hand tools and the power tools, right away we get them building something. Even if it starts with pulling nails, make sure they know how to do things safely and just keep on going. The freshman class project, a modular learning lab or MOLE, is the result of training and teamwork. It's one thing to learn from a book and you know connect the dots in that manner, but when you actually get to build something and touch it and, and kick it around and, and tear it apart and rebuild it again, uh, those are the opportunities I think uh, stay in your mind a lot longer and, and learn and, and be a lot more lasting than learning and something in a book and then taking a test. In their junior year, students will select a specialty area from six different strands. The advisory team said to us, these are four areas where we really think you should concentrate. And that's the uh, carpentry, the electricity, the HVAC, the pipe fitting, the welding. That's where they said, we need those skills right now. But as we started to recruit students and listen to what they had to say and listen to what their parents had to say, we then realized that there was a strong group that wanted also the architecture and the engineering. So we added that to the program. The professional community is ready to open their doors to CCA students. I think we're all very anxious to figure out opportunities or ways that we can interact with these students, whether it's uh, through you know, office visits or, or job site visits or any number of ways that, that we can all participate. I think uh, most would be willing to and ready to, to participate. With opportunities to earn industry-recognized certifications and college credit, Construction Careers Academy students are building momentum throughout high school and will graduate with more than a diploma. If I were going to go into college, I'd be taking some of these classes that I'm taking now. So it's like I'm already starting my college career here in high school, and plus I don't have to pay for it. We also get certifications from the National Center for Instructional Education and Research as they pass tests in their classes. Coupled with that, they'll get about 30 credits that are articulated with St. Philip's two-year program in construction. Uh, science as well. So they can go there already with college credit or they can go to any other four-year institution and be ready to go. It's never too early to plan for the future or search for your dream career. CCA can be the start of something big. Now I think it's up to the students to uh, take it for a test drive, so to speak. Uh, there's some great programs within the school and spend as much time learning about each of them along the way. When I tell people I go to construction careers, they kind of give me this really weird look like you go to construction careers. But no one ever thinks of the architecture and interior design like I do. Um, 
and I do love power tools, even though I am a girl. By having Construction Careers Academy where they have four years to prepare for where they want to go, they can, do, they can do both. They can go on to college, go into construction management, go into architecture, go into design, go into engineering if they want to, but they could also go into the workforce if they want to and earn good salaries. With a mix of classroom and lab-based learning, a state-of-the-art facility and dedicated faculty, Construction Careers Academy students will discover what it takes to succeed in college and the construction industry.